One of the things I used to really like at school was when we did show and tell. I don't know if you ever had that. You got to find something in your house that's weird that you can show other people about. I'm sure you did this as a kid. Um, some of you will know what this is because you've been to clown college. I know all of those kids going to Broadview, your school is good at teaching you how to be clowns. I've, I figured that much out. This is a tiny bike and it's not really rideable, you would think, because it is obviously too small for me. But I have tested this, and I don't know if we can do this with the camera. This is gonna test Oliver's skills. Can we move around? I'm going to try to bike, and I'll show you, not only can I bike on this tiny little bike, I can even do it on the carpet, which makes it that much funner. So we'll hit the little bump, get too close to Kristen for social distancing comforting and see if we can make a turn. Hey, oh, look at that. If I could juggle, we'd be all set. Now, I'm not doing this for no reason at all. I'm doing it because we're talking today about John the Baptist again, and what John does is a form of show and tell. He gathers a group of people, and they want to know what he has to say. And what he does is he shows them Jesus. He says, Jesus is really important and you should follow him. You should listen to him. He's much more important than I am. We all have the ability to do that. We get to show and tell the world Jesus. We can do that in our actions, kind of like how I can show you how to ride the clown bike. And we can also tell people, like I can explain to you how a clown bike works, why it holds my weight, even though I'm too big for it how you can ride it with kids sitting on the handlebars, even with my wife sitting on the handlebars, and have a lot of fun. And you teach people the joy and the fun and the amusement you can have with these kind of things. Similarly, we can share Jesus with others and tell them where we find joy and amusement in that as well. And so I challenge you to try to do that at some point, to show other people Jesus, either in the way you act or actually by talking about him. Would you pray with me? Dear Father, help us this week to do our own show and tell, to show and tell others about you and mostly. Amen.